Hi everyone. Um, today we'll learn how to deploy a, uh, a SolidDB smart contract, uh, which will deploy on top of an EVM chain, uh, which is already deployed on top of a WASP node, or a WASP chain and a WASP node. Uh, so for that, uh, first we need to obviously you know, deploy a, uh, we have to run a WASP node, which is running right here. And we need a WASP chain, which, is, which should be active. And uh, we can verify that by just going to here and we should have a was EVM chain already deployed and uh, ready to go. Uh, once you have that much ready, uh, just just go to your uh, just go to your terminal and we should have to start a JSON RPC server, which our MetaMask will connect to and will help us in deploying the smart contract. We'll be using uh, Remix for this, so that becomes very straightforward on how to you know go about that. Uh, to verify, just uh, just connect with your WASP test uh, network, which we did in the last one, and uh, we should be good to go. We are, we are going with a very simple smart contract. It is a very it is a simple storage smart contract. Uh, it has two functions: set and get. Is, get is a view function, so it will just get whatever value is in the number uh, variable, and the set will set whatever number integer we send uh, to, uh, to to this uh, to this function. And we'll put it uh, put it up there. One very important thing to notice is that whatever version you put up in this uh, first line of the SOLID program, uh, your compiler, your SOLID compiler should also have the same file, the SOLD uh, file. Uh, so make sure that you have matched that. You compile the the your and you, once you have compiled it, um, you can go back to let's say your uh, your Remix environment. Uh, you can obviously test it using the uh, the VM which Remix provides, which, will, which won't use any funds at all, so you can play around with this as much as possible. Uh, right now, obviously, we can we obviously want to play around as as well. So, uh, but our in our case, our committee uh, has decided to go with the gas fees of zero, so our transaction fees will still zero in this case. Uh, however, in your live scenario, your your transaction fees might be there. There might be some value to it, so feel free to you know test it out on test environments and then. Go with an injected web3 what injected web3 will do is it will fetch whatever network metamask is connected to and it will inject onto this browser right and uh, in this case you can see you know, the address that is there is also here and it was uh, copied whatever uh, whatever ethos was available in in this case and uh, now we want to just deploy it once you click on deploy it uh, creates a pop-up and it will ask to confirm and uh, there's a way to also sign uh, whatever we are trying to send. In this case, you can verify the data, which will be a smart contract uh, data itself. And uh, once you do that, uh, now we have creation of simple storage pending. So let's give it a moment. Um, based on uh, how much transaction phase it is and how much of a network is congestion, your, your chain, uh, this might take more or less time, uh, but for us, it's done. It's deployed. We can uh, see the details of the transaction right over here. This transaction is a transaction has. This is the address which is originated from, and it created a contract. Right. So we know that it is deployed right now. Uh, we can also see the contract, which is uh, can be shown, uh, which can be shown in the deployed contract spot. And there are two functions obviously we can interact with them if we do get it's obviously zero because there is nothing set in here so let's try to set let's say one two three once you try to set it this is this will initiate another transaction obviously because uh, every everything that we write onto uh, a, a, a blockchain will essentially be a contract right so we'll have to sign that as well uh, so you can see that the transact is pending which means that which means that our transaction is in process so and now here's, here's, it is done, it says. So once we get this, we will now get that full value. And that's about it. Feel free to um, try out other contracts. You can write other contracts over here. Um, you can create your own workspace and write it in there. It's uh, up to you. But uh, that's about it about deploying a solid based smart contract uh, using Remix and MetaMask. Thank you so much.